Welcome to the Academy. Today we will take a look at the top 5 differences between Node.js and Deno. If you want to see more web development top lists, hit the subscribe button. Now let's see the differences. Number 5. Security. Deno takes security seriously. It executes the code in a sandbox, opposed to Node, so by default our program do not have access to the file system, network, environment variables and the execution of other scripts. If we want to use these resources, we have to ask for permissions or use the corresponding security flags when we run our scripts. Number 4. TypeScript The TypeScript compiler is baked into Deno by default. All you have to do is to name your files with .ts extension and you can use TypeScript in your code right away. No configurations or installations needed. However, in Node.js, you have to install TypeScript, update package.json, add a tsconfig file, and make sure that your modules have type supported. Number 3. Browser API Unlike Node, Deno has access to the Browser API, which means that you can use anything from the Browser API without installing any packages. For example, you can use fetch out of the box, while in Node, you have to install the node fetch package. You have native access to the window object too. This leads to cleaner code and less package imports. Number 2. ES modules. Deno fully supports ES modules, so we can use import just like you use it in React for example. ES modules have two major advantages over require, which is the node way of importing dependencies. Require is loading resources synchronously, while import is loading asynchronously, which is more performant. Also, with import you can load only the pieces of the package that you need and save some precious memory. Number 1. Decentralized packages. With Deno you can forget npm packages and the big sized node modules folders. Packages are instead imported from URLs and cached to the hard drive on load. This means that the imported dependency is cached and it do not have to be downloaded again if you want to use it anywhere else. Honorable mention. Testing. Deno has a built-in test runner that we can use for testing our JavaScript or TypeScript code. The syntax will be pretty familiar if you are comfortable with popular JavaScript testing libraries like Jest or Jasmine. Fun fact. Did you know that Deno is an anagram for Node? Have you tried Deno yet? Do you like these updates compared to Node? Leave your thoughts in the comment section below. See you folks in the next video.